Due to issues that I mentioned in the update video I uploaded yesterday, I decided to make this video a lot longer to make up for the lack of content that was on Tuesday and Wednesday. So I hope you enjoyed this really, really long video, and I hope to see you guys next week. Alright, breaking into the church. There's supposed to be something up here. That woman mentioned something about a thieves key. There it is. I'll take this. You found the thieves key recipe. Put it in my bag. Oh look. There's a giant waterfall over there. I think that's where we need to go next. Let's have a look at that recipe real quick. Use. The co combine an iron nail and a bronze knife. You will need the device called the alchemy pot to combine the items. So we need... In order to make this thieves key, we need some items. And of course, an alchemy pot. But where the fuck are we going to get an alchemy pot from? Too bad I'm poor. Mm. If only I knew where to get one. Oh well, never mind. I guess we'll just have to make two and try to steal one. I mean, I've got a band with me apparently, so that will do. We'll just use him to steal it. Oh my god, I told you already, I'm not going back to stealing! Well, you, you, you said that though, but we may need this alchemy pot. I'M NOT STEALING, GOD, FOR FUCK'S <laughs> SAKE! <laughs> That's what he's actually thinking. Alright, let's go. Let's go and see Valentina. Oh. She's dead. Oh well, I better go and steal her stuff. <laughs> no, get back to here! Oh cool, four gold. That was my pocket money. You don't get pocket money. <laughs> oh, you get a job like most women. Get out on the streets. <laughs> <laughs> no, he would never say that. Counter Rush is not like that. He's just a drunk. He's a drunk, but he's not a bad father. And, oh, actually, wait. Actually, no one I've said that sense, that doesn't make sense at all. He's an alcoholic, <laughs> but he's not a bad father. <laughs> a book called Monster Behavior. After many long years spent researching monsters, I have reached an unexpected conclusion. It appears that nocturnal monsters are far stronger and more vicious than their daytime counterparts. What an incredible discovery! Now I must redouble any efforts to fathom the secrets of monster biology. And how to fuck a mermaid. <laughs> Look, it has to be possible. They've got boobs, so they must have a pussy. Hey. Perhaps. Hey. What are you doing sleeping? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, look. Sleeping on tower cards may not be the best idea. Was she drinking like... Uh, yeah, yeah. Was, was, was she drinking like drugs? Uh, big hey. penis. Wake up! Hi. <laughs> that smile. Oh, you came. Hi. Uh, what? Uh, <clears throat> uh how? Uh, I must have drifted off. How rude of me. <laughs> uh, I uh, wanted to ask you a favor about this crystal ball. What's wrong with it? Uh, uh, I don't fucking know yet. Um, <laughs> I need to think about it, but uh, I'm getting ahead of myself. Perhaps I should start from the beginning. I like maybe that. Then I'll, maybe I'll figure it out along the way. <laughs> I like that. I don't know yet. I'm waiting for the script to tell me what's happening. <laughs> yeah, uh, the script's terrible. <clears throat> of course, let me explain. So. <clears throat> my my daddy, you my, my the big dog Kaltarasha, was once a really famous fortune teller, as oh. the game's already portrayed to you, and he fucking sucks now. I didn't need to know about the daddy part. Shut up. <laughs> Lost treasure, missing people, people pressing the X button. Oh. There was nothing the great Kaltarasha could help people with. <laughs> he couldn't like he was helping people to. What, stop committing suicide or committing suicide? Um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I was a little baby. <laughs> but then, one day he lost his powers. All of a sudden, nothing he foretold turned out to be true anymore. It's probably because he stopped using a real crystal ball. This glass ball isn't- Hey, what the bloody are you doing, Valentina? Uh, nothing else is How many times have been... I told you not to touch me bloody balls? I didn't, I haven't touched I, it. I knew the boy from the pub. What brings you here? You yeah, fucking never mind. I don't know what my daughter has asked you, but you forget it. 
You do not, I do not need your help. I'm fine as I am. I'm going to bed. Valentina, say farewell and show your young visitor to the door. Oh, and, fuck you. And get his money. <laughs> no, what the fuck? I didn't tell him you took all the money we had, but I'm sorry about my father. Hey! Where's me, where's me seven gold? Um, you spent it at the pub. Oh! You're right, I did. Oh, <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Oh, 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 God. Just, just go, go to sleep, Dad. Just oh. go to sleep. Oh, come here, Marshmallow. Oh, fuck. But whatever he says, he's the, he's the one who's really suffering since he lost his powers. Ah, oh, yes, Miss Bunny Lady and Bar. Let me see those bosom booms. I think he's masturbating. Um, <clears throat> but please, please ignore him. He does that all the time when he sleeps. <laughs> she sleeps right next to him. <laughs> <laughs> it's very unfortunate. But um, th th that's why I wanted to ask you this favor. Uh, can you? Find him a crystal ball, one that's big enough to bring back his powers, please. So he can stop going out to drink all the time and masturbating next to me while he sleeps. Well, well with that kind of backstory, yes. <gasps> really? You know? Oh, this is fucking, fucking crazy, guys. <laughs> Thank you. This has happened in my dream. So far, everything's come true. Yay. I also dread that there's a crystal ball hidden deep inside the cave under the big waterfall to the south of the town. I suppose only the daughter of the great Calderasha could know a thing like that. Yes. Let's go and, let's go and spy on him. Oh, I'll, I'll be laughing my eyes. I'll be laughing my ass off. Oh, wait, I fucked up that sentence there. Your eyes off. <laughs> it's, because, it's because what I was going to say was I would be laughing my ass off if he actually, if his eyes would just open and he just stare at the ceiling, <laughs> pretend to be asleep. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Yes. I... He seems to be fast asleep. And there's the smell of jizz in the room. Time to leave. <laughs> I'm sorry for your loss, Valentina. I have to go now. Yeah, I'll just fall asleep again. It's okay. She falls asleep with the flipping table because she doesn't want to go in the. She doesn't want to be in the same bed. <laughs> I don't want to go back to bed anymore. <laughs> it smells. It smells bad everywhere. <laughs> Let me out. Let's go and see the bastard. I see. Magnificent! Holy fuck! Such devotion to her father. <laughs> I'm impressed. Just how our daughter should be. And if this Count of Russia gets his powers back, there's nothing he can't find. Am I right? Then we'll have to. Then we'll kill two birds with one stone. Everything goes according to plan. We'll find out where that hateful Dumagus is, and the, and what time's going on. But Dale and I will stay outside. That's the last time we set foot in a. Barbaric town like this, but you should spend the night at the inn, and we will rest and rest well, so you that you're ready to take on the world tomorrow. In the morning, we leave for the waterfall cave. All right, see you, dude. <laughs> God, God, let's go back to our house. Not for fuck's sake, Yangus, no. <laughs> good morning. Hope you had a good rest. It was so dark, so I can't be sure, but I think the uh, little old man you came with in the wagon us outside the gates last night. Anyway, have a safe trip. I don't want to have a safe trip with a person like you. You're a racist. You were mean. Feels, feels bad, man. You, you were being mean to King Trode, you monsters. There's the kitty. Just skulking around. Meow. <laughs> I'm just going to watch the cat for a bit. What's, what's his plan? He's just gonna sit there and do nothing. Where are you going, cat? What is he up to? Oh. It's kinda weird how the, it's kinda weird that there's like a crackling noise from that building even though there shouldn't be. 
Because it's in the fact being like... Yeah, like, isn't a fire supposed to be in it for a few days now? <laughs> it should have been. Well, I don't know. Something weird's going on in this place. Oh, look, it's that guy who screams. Let's not talk to him. He's an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you're Trevor, eh? Just like me. Always always best not to ask Travis where they're going, I say. We all have our own personal reasons, after all. I mean, fair enough. I can sort of agree to that. He's uh, traveling for pussy. I'm looking for that puss puss. It's around here somewhere. See, he, 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 see, he sees a cat and he's just like, that'll do. <laughs> oh, there's the pussy I've been looking for. <laughs> oh, don't you disobey me, cat. <laughs> Hello, Evo. I was starting to think you got lost. Right, let's go to the waterfall cave and see if we can find that crystal ball. Midea and I will be right behind you. If you have any trouble, feel free to console us. I am sure there's nothing we, we can solve when we put our heads together. Anyway, away we go. It tells you about what happens if you die. I know about what happens if I die. It's normal. It's a normal thing to feel when you die. But oh well, I guess I'll die eventually. On with our adventure. Let's go look for shit and get to that waterfall cave. But I have to go and do the long way around because I gotta go look for shit like items. They are important. Items. We gotta get items for our quest. Otherwise, how else are we gonna survive in this horrible world? Oh no. I found bell pe I found bell peppers and freaking bunny horns. Don't know how I feel about oh. this. Horny bunnies. <laughs> Very funny. Ah. Uh. There's the weed. Weed helps everything. I wouldn't be in, I wouldn't be in like a situation if that fucking bell pepper didn't drop my defense. They're dead. Yeah, level two. The hero is now stronger than before. And Yang is now level 2. Perfect. They leveled the exact same time. I'm happy with that. But I got nothing from that. Oh well. Never mind. I'll have to just live with that for the rest of my life. But first. Okay, all healed up. What's in this chest? Or can I not open it? I can't open it because I need the fucking key. Perfect. Feels bad, man. You came all the way over here and you can't get into it. Alright. What a, what, a, what a day to be alive. Fucking being towed off for not being able to use it. Oh, not well, you, there's, 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 there's plenty of trees, man. You can press the X button. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Next to any of them. <laughs> that sounds like the perfect idea. Kill myself by just deciding to just go. Hey, look. Look at all these trees. Perfect. Look Sorry, Angus. It's time. <laughs> oh, no, don't do that. <laughs> Get oh, down yeah. from there. Okay. Just fucking hangs himself. No, not like that. <laughs> Oh no, not again! <laughs> Let's see. Gotta grind a bit. That's gonna be the fun part. Might as well spend some time doing some grinding to make sure we're grind ready. Grind to grind. Yep, let's grind. 100% 24 7 grind. Oh my god. Look at these lips. Th th those are uh, some. Uh... Uh, dick sucking lips. <laughs> Just a bit. The one's dead. Oh no. They deserve to die. They're abominations. Uh... Alright, it's gone. Alright. Time to do some cutting out of stuff. Particularly of cutting out of, of flipping grinding because no one wants to watch that. But we're getting. So we got our work to cut. We got our work cut out for. We're gonna get to level 7. Holy heck. Look, a sheep. <laughs> oh, it's way to bam. <laughs> Imagine you could just kick them over. <laughs> That'd be really fucking funny. <laughs> Die, cats. They don't even look like cats, so. But they are the candy cats. And they make cat noises. <laughs> Dead. Alright, there's a strong enemy around here that gives me like a flipping copper coin, but I don't want that. For a, for a variety of reasons. 
because they will just kill me. God fucking damn it, slimes. Oh, cool. He learned heal. Perfect. Only one problem. I haven't got any fucking MP. Well, this is actually... Feels bad, man. Well, I've got to think that will take me back to town if I need to rest. Call me Westy Lights, fingers in his ass. <laughs> Check this who suit. Maybe there's some guy in here. Maybe he'll give me stuff, particularly for a mouse. Hello, person. I'm here to look for your stuff. You have a bunch of axes. That would come in handy if I ever needed them, but you won't give me them, so... I'll just take what you have, like this seed of agility. Oh, you cheeky bugger. Stop taking me shit. <laughs> oh, I just found the ship. Feels bad, man. Oh, I don't get visitors all, up here, all the way up here. Well, now you're here. Maybe I can ask you a little favor. Okay, I'm going to say this once, so clear out your ears and get listening. If you go outside and look at the view from the top of the mountain, you should be able to spot a tree with red leaves. I had a bit of a kip there when I was out there the other day, but it seems I left my tool bag behind. I did expect you to do this for free, of course. I'll be able to give you a small reward. I'll be waiting here in my hut for you to bring it back. Try not to take too long. You did. You did. You shouldn't have said. You shouldn't have said too long, because now I'm gonna take forever. You've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> no. A Jake Kitty is a happy scion. Dead Kitty's dead. Dead Kitty's are dead. I thought you were gonna be like some kind of. Pun with your with your new name, just because back then it's a K and cats. And some people have spelled cat with a K. Uh, a dead kitty, a dead cat, a dead cat, sunk. Yeah, uh, <laughs> kill me. <laughs> X button. <laughs> a dead cat, sunk. Me spamming the X button. <laughs> I don't think it's working. No. Ah, shit, it's because I don't have a PlayStation. No. <laughs> Damn it, if only I had one. Damn. If I got these cats, I only do one damage. I don't know why. They are not valid. They're not valid. <laughs> well, that one's dead. I made it. I made it invalid. No. Die, kitty. Dead bastard. Okay, how am I doing on gold? Just out of curiosity's sake. Okay, not too bad. I could I could use more money. Money. We can always use more money. More money to f uh, fund um. Yang is yeah, he likes fingers in his. <laughs> no, he doesn't. <laughs> no, he doesn't. <laughs> Oh, I get. I guess because it's you saying that, that makes perfect sense. Yeah, this is one hundred percent factual canon. Sorry, guys. Are you gonna do that post on the Fifteen Dragon Quest wiki? Yeah, I'll just ha ha hack into it and be like Yangus likes fingers in his ass, and yeah. It wouldn't have to do anything because most wiki pages can just be edited by anyone. <laughs> True. So you can let me just go on there and just write that down and just wait and just see, and just see what how long it takes people to actually realize that. <laughs> and then they go, wait a second. I don't remember that quote being Dragon Quest VIII. Someone's <laughs> telling porkies. <laughs> and then they'll go and investigate and then they'll play the game and figure, oh, oh, I guess, I guess he actually did. I guess he actually did say that. <laughs> he did like, like having fingers in his bum. <laughs> that would be really funny, that. But he, like a... to, but he can't get fingers in his ass anymore because he can't reach. He's too fat. <laughs> he, has to so he has to get someone else to do it. He gets King. He gets King Troll to do it. Oh no! <laughs> he waits until he's asleep and he just grabs his hand, just like, oh yeah. He's in my ass. <laughs> he just cool. wakes up and he's like, oh, my hand smells funny. Hmm. That's probably nothing. <laughs> Did I accidentally stick my hand in Medea's body? My language, poop. <laughs> it's 
That was Yankus is just sit, sitting at the side, just with the smuggest grin on his face. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? What the hell are these abominations? Well, they're gonna die anyway. Oh, you know. Oh, well, that happened. I fell asleep. Feels bad, man. Oh, now I'm awake. Now it's dead. <laughs> Die, motherfucker. Good, now I'm deaf. I love being deaf. What a great way to be alive. Being fucking full blast in my fucking earlobes. I love yeah, it. Yeah, man. What a great way to be alive. Just shout them in my ears. It's not like I need my ears. That's a pretty tree. It's a uh, uh, orange, destiny. Oh god, it's the dancing devil. He's found me! Dancing devil likes fingers in its ass. <laughs> Bet it probably would, actually. <laughs> it looks at like the type to have to, to stick its own fingers on its butt. Uh, the fingers are long enough, so you know. Oh, he's gonna die. Okay, maybe next turn. Ow. Bastard. Did you just die already? There, you're dead. No more fingers up your butt. <laughs> That's pretty strange that, like, there's just light around here, but there isn't any light. What is just the moon? <laughs> No, you have to walk it all the way back. <laughs> yep. Once I can see the moon. There's the moon. Hey. It's moving. Yeah. This game's got like a pretty quick um day and night cycle, so it actually feels like you actually just waiting for a while for it to go to day. In fact, if you wait long enough, you can actually see the sun starting to rise. Oh, there's a chest over there. <laughs> just, just interrupt your train of thought, like, oh, there's a chest. There's a chest over there, either. Please be unlocked. You, you get there and it's, it's locked. Aw, oh, damn it, there's a fucking weird thing <laughs> going on. That This thing's got a weird box thing around it. I better kill it. Ow, that really hurt. Oh, nice, I guess you critical hit it. Now it's dead. Don't worry, bastard. You're dead now. Yay, level four for Yingus. Good one, Yingus. You're level four now. Okay, so let's see. For grinding purposes, we need more axes. Even though he's not using the axe, he's using the club. But I'll take axes are my best weapon for Yingus. Mainly for it's mainly for grinding purposes. Like, oh, cool. Yes! More gold! Perfect. Alright. One thing to do in this situation. I don't trust my luck with battles. Return to town by teleport. Fly! Fly, Camille Wing! Fly! <laughs> ah, here we are. That didn't take too long. What the hell? What's he doing? Hmm. He's fanning around with something in the frippin' wagon. Oh, you know. Du -du. Oh, it's a little rabbit. I bet it kill it. Ah. Go away, Yuka. I'm killing the rabbit. Ah. Oh, need chan he's being mean to the bunny rabbit. Oh, need chan stop it. <laughs> oh, <need -chan. laughs> That'd be really funny, like, she called, like, um, Yuya Oni-chan as well. She wouldn't know which one she's talking about, and she'll just get confused. <laughs> like, she's, like, she's talking to Satoshi, but Yuya's the only one there, and she's like, ah, oh, fuck. Exactly. Goodbye, rabbit. She just yells, oni <laughs> Oni-chan! Yuya's like, yes, no, not you. <laughs> He's like, what? No, not you. Him. <laughs> oh, that could be you're supposed to be. You're supposed to be dead. <laughs> you can never kill me. I am Yuya Kazami. 
Half of your skin is missing. <laughs> well, you didn't have to tell me that. <laughs> didn't it feel a bit more breezy? <laughs> well, no, you mentioned that. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, hmm. <laughs> I'm deaf. Da -da. Oh great! I may have just got—I may have just been given herpes by this thing. No. Dead. Hey, hey Gov. Uh, once we kill it, can we just uh, uh, take the lips? <laughs> no, we're not taking the bloody <laughs> lips, Yangus. And you had your fresh life. <laughs> Christ, Jankus, what the fuck? Look, ever since you saw that bloody, ever since we saw, ever, ever since we saw Valentine, you've been acting weird. It's called having a boner, Gov. I'll get blue balls if I don't. Really... <laughs> My balls are so blue, they're bluer than the slimes. Help! <laughs> My balls will become slimes themselves. <laughs> we'll change smiley faces. <laughs> Instead of smiley faces, don't be sad, cause. <laughs> <laughs> and then they'll get angry that you don't let me have anything, Gov. Please, you, Gov. And you want and you won't want to see some red balls. <laughs> God, that'd be so fucking funny if that actually happened. <laughs> be an interesting conversation, I'll say that much. <laughs> All right, if I remember correctly, there's supposed to be a enemy along this way. Just like the um, the slime knight, there's like a dinosaur hanging around around here. Oh. Oh, oh look, slimmels. It, look, it's blue balls. Oh, feck, you bastards. I gotta kill one of them. Oh, there goes my ears. Ah, oh, my ears again. Now I can hear again. That's how that works. Yeah, that's totally how it works, right? They blew in my ears, make me go deaf. Oh no. Oh, Yangus, no! God damn it, Yangus! Well, oh, my... maybe you can sleep off that boner. <laughs> oh no, it's growing bigger! It's getting, no. bigger it's getting bigger than the trees! No! <laughs> it can't be stopped. <laughs> oh, what? What's happened? Where am I? <laughs> <laughs> like he has no idea where the fuck he is. He's like, oh, 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 oh shit! I can't, I can't walk. My just too heavy. <laughs> there it is. There's the dinosaur. Murder him. No, I'm not strong enough. I definitely know I'm not strong enough. If I, me <laughs> if I remember correctly, that dinosaur has stupidly high attack power. If I remember correctly. <laughs> anyway, I gotta. I gotta like try to balance these things out so I can then power up again. Because these things are just gonna keep killing me. So kill one more and I don't have to worry about micromanaging my health. Alright, there we go. So now I'll just randomly attack whoever now. All for the prosperity of powering up. <laughs> Good thing my be good thing my beer belly's actually got is like a shield, Gav. <laughs> I mean that thing should be killing me with its fucking horn. Yeah. I'm not in a high tension yet. Still not there yet. Well, better cut now. Poor little bastard. Didn't even stand a chance. Oh no. No, don't lag now. Why are you lagging? <laughs> no. It's like lagging. Wait, is it because it's is it because of the setting the sun? It might be. Okay, then if that's the case, I just need to do one small adjustment then. I was listening to more of the hype on the in the Goblet of Fire, and I found out something. You know that scene we were talking about with David Tennant in it, where he's like going, "Hello, father." Yeah. Well, it turns out in the in the book, 
He's like going, please, Dad, I didn't do it. I wasn't trying to bring back Lord Voldemort. Like he was actually, it was not like, so like the scene that actually happens in the movie is the scene with um, Igor Kakarov. And he's like telling people, I didn't do it. I'm actually, I'll give you names. And he commences like saying, it, it's Barty Crouch Jr. And then he tries to make a run for it. But in actuality, like, it's more or less a problem with, it, like, like he tries like he tries ran out a bunch of people. Then after that, there's like another trial, but like one of the other characters in it, uh, something it's something Bagman. I forgot what his name is. He's like a he was like a really good um seeker for like um I forgot what it was again. I, like I like when you hear a lot of stuff, it's hard to take in all the information. But mm. that trial happens, and it turns out he was actually a Death Eater, and then and Harry was like, he was a Death Eater. What the fuck? But he was, but he was like, I, but you please understand. I didn't actually know. I was deceived. And everyone like believes him and all. I'm thinking, oh, is he? What did he actually get deceived, or was he? Was he just a really good actor? And I don't really know at this point. And then when he gets to the trial, like, there's more death eaters and all that that like get brought in, and along with Barty Crouch's son, and he, along, and I think um, what's her name? Oh, fuck, I forgot her name. Oh, shit. It's on the tip of my tongue right now. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. What's the name? Better tricks the, str the strange is there with, with them, I think. And she's all like, Beware! The Dark Lord will come back and he'll when we'll get our revenge. And I says, Well, you're going, well, you're going to ask about it. And, and he's like, Dad, please, I didn't do it. And he's all like, I have no son! <laughs> And then they go to Azkaban, and then apparently Barty Cr Crouch Jr. dies, and his mother's like, <laughs> and she faints when he mentions, I have no son! And then, like, and like Harry's all like, what the f-? And then, like, Dumbledore's like saying, Harry, I think it's time to go back. And then ha Harry turns to him thinking, what the fuck? There's two Dumbledores! <laughs> That's the what happens in that scene. It's. <laughs> Pretty accurate. Don't you calmly wash your that was don't you calmly wash your ears. You know what happens when an animal washes its ears? It dies! Stupid cat. What are they, what are they even good for? Being cute. Okay, apart from that. I mean, it could be used for killing rats. I mean, that's a thing. I mean, it just comes down to what kind of thing you want the rat to do. I mean, the mount. I mean, the cat to do. Fuck! <laughs> now I'm thinking. Now I'm thinking about rats. I want the rat to pull my hair and make me a chef. Or you, or you literally just want to have like some kind of disease. Yes, because I have crippling depression and wish to die. <laughs> I was being like having like a disease, a, a disease infested rat on your head. Oh. Did you not think about that? No. Oh no, the rat killed me. How? Because I have depression. It didn't I kill have depression, it. that's why. It isn't because the fact being that the rat had a disease. Well, it's probably that, well, it, might, it may have been that, but I'm pretty sure it was depression. It seems more unlikely that it was the flipping um, depression that killed me. I mean, don't look at How me. How am I telling you this? Well, you see, I am a ghost. <laughs> How am I telling you this? Well, you see, it's not me telling the story. It's the rack and in my corpse that's doing it. Record scratch. Yeah, that's me. You're probably wondering how I got into this situation. <laughs> well, it all started when we went to the hospital and stole his corpse. And then we wanted to. And then I thought, wouldn't it, wouldn't it be funny to make Ratatouille 2, but make it more adult and instead of being a human? We're a rat controlling a human, it's a rat controlling a corpse. Long story short, it did not, it's long, long story short, it didn't, too, it didn't do too well at the box office. Thankfully, it didn't do too well. <laughs> no, not, lo not lucky enough, it didn't, no, not lucky enough, it says unfortunately it didn't do too well at the box office. <laughs> like, what would be the point of making the movie then if it didn't do too well at the box office? Oh, you know. Unless you didn't want people to see the movie. 
I made it for myself and I only let, let release it to public so I could watch it in the cinema and you know, it, 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 I wouldn't have to get all that surround sound in my own house. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like such a pointless thing to do. Make sure it goes to every single fucking c cinema so I can fucking watch it. Yeah, that's basically it. I just... <laughs> I just, well, that's just like costing a lot of money just to fucking put your stupid movie in the fucking cinema. Look, put it in the cinema because I have no, because I've just spent all my money just trying to fucking invest in this movie. A rat controlling a corpse? I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure people won't watch it though, but hey, I mean, maybe some people will. Maybe, that, maybe that's a kink for them. You know, there's like porn with a lot of things like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles porn. That's a real thing. Maybe people would be interested in seeing Ratatouille 2 with an actual corpse. Now you laugh at that, but there actually is a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles porno. With people oh. with people actually dressing up as um the turtles. Oh. And one of the weird things is that um Shredder isn't a man, he's a woman in that film. Hey. You know mm. <laughs> And until recently I found out there was a Rugrats porno. Oh no. Yeah, but basically it's like adults, but they're wearing like the 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 kids' clothing. And like the guy playing Tommy has a beard and he's in a diaper. Oh. Yeah, like I, I only know that though because I actually because I what because like I saw a review of it. Actually, I didn't watch it all the way through. I need to get back to watching it. It's a, it's a review done by the cinema snob reviewing the movie. Well, the porno really. And it's like weird thing is is that they even like they even like make like their own little title card with it and it's like strangely close to how it actually would be in the show. Oh. It's like so bizarre and weird. But I do appreciate good at trying to be authentic with it, but thank god they didn't like try to hire like children doing the porno. Because then that's where it'd be awkward, but I don't understand why they didn't like go with the, the whole old grown up concept. Because, you know, that was, um, that was a show too. Because remember that spin off show that they created? Do you remember yeah. that? Yeah. So I'm just wondering why they didn't like just go with that idea. They could have just, they could have just caught it, or <laughs> they could have like caught it something clever, like. I don't- I, I can't think of anything clever right now, but I'll think of something. <laughs> All bulged out, maybe? i <laughs> bulged. <laughs> it sounds like something that will probably work. Ah, you found it! Let's see. Do you remember that we went to go and find this guy's fucking tool bag? Uh, uh, d d d d did we? Uh... Yeah, that's what happened in the last session. Like, we went looking for this guy's tool bag, and he left it by a fucking tree that had red leaves. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yep, this is the one. This is definitely my tool bag. Thanks, I suppose I better give you the reward I promised. Oh, uh, hey! What's that? Oh, is that a little mouse you got there? That's no normal mouse. How the fuck do you know it's not a normal mouse? I mean, it has a mohawk, but don't say that. <laughs> it's your pet, isn't it, right? Uh, yeah, I mean, why would he? Why would I just keep a random mouse with me in my pocket? Oh, yeah. Take this here choice as reward. You give me feckin' cheese? Oh, cool, I got eight pieces of plain cheese in my bag. It may just be plain old cheese, but that is just plain old cheese. Well, why'd you give it to us then? We don't want this shit. Well, you just give it to your mouse. Oh, yeah, take a bus. <laughs> oh, I mean, you can eat it too if you want, but I'm just saying it's mainly for the moose. The moose. <laughs> yes, but that mouse of yours is sure to like it. Hey, I could be wrong, but try giving it sometime. Sometime you've got yourself in a fight with some monsters. You never know what might happen. Anyways, that's enough noise out of me. Thanks again for bringing me my backpack. Don't understand why you couldn't just do it yourself, but okay, thanks for the cheese. I'm trying to figure like I'm trying to figure like more clever puns you can go with. Freaking all all grown up, <laughs> all tits out. All titties out. Uh. All titties out. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you could be weird and say all periods out, and I'll be like a oh, weird. Oh no! As I'm saying, you could be weird. I mean, if you really want to be creative, you can let me go all mouse out. 
Like they are like, like, like all the girl, like Angelica and all them are like moms and all that, and it's like some weird. Oh no! It, oh it, no! <laughs> it's like some weird. Oh, no! It, it's like some weird incest freaking porno or something like that. Uh huh. Like that's like the weird thing with like any with that's like the one thing I find really odd with anyone that makes Rugrax porn. It's that little bit of knowledge that there's gonna be like incest involved in it. Yeah. That's like the weird thing about. It. I figure I've no actually speaking of which I've come across one of those actually by accident. Oh no. It was like it is based. Funny enough, it's actually based on all grown up, and the idea was that. Charlotte Angelica's mom was like trying to get uh, Dylan to like give her like an idea for like a game or something like that. So instead, of, so he's like going, "No, yo, you have to do better than that. You have to try off some gum." She's like, "Figured, okay, off my body then." He figured, "Oh yeah, let's do that then." And then she like signs the contract then and all that. Figured, well, well, that was pointless <laughs> and weird. You just fucked your aunt for sending out your idea. But okay, oh look, a monster. No, oh, oh, god damn it, I wanted to fight the monster. Oh god damn it's bell peppers. Oh speaking of which, I came across um I came across uh my Hero Academia porno and it was literally called um Uraka uh, U <laughs> it was called Uraka uh, Uraka's Prostitution. Oh no. Like I think the idea of it all was like like, I, I quickly skimmed through it real quick just to see what the fuck it was. But the idea was, was to get, was, Iraka was trying to get money for Midoriya's, like, um, hosp for hospital bills. Because he was in hospital at the time that it happened. So she decided, like, to do prostitution or that, though. But then she got, like, everyone else involved and say, like, well, and, like, what happens is, like, they create, like, a freaking prostitution thing for Class 1A. And he says, welcome to Class 1A prostitution where you have, you have to where you can do whatever you want to us, but you have to like, pay a small fee. And then... Oh no. And then it gets even weirder, where like, like, Bakugo Biaka, uh, is like, saying that, he's like, he's doing uh, Ochako, and he's like, thinking, you're thinking of mid array like, he's better than me, and I'm saying, well, I'm gonna make you my woman now. And, like, and, oh like, no. I don't uh, like that. Yeah, <laughs> and like, he's like, basically just doing it out of spite, just to freaking taunt mid -area. And like at the end of it, he, at the end of it, like, uh, like, Uraka, uh, Uraka's like going and said, "Sorry, Midoriya, but I'm now in love with B uh, Bakugo's cock." He keep almost saying Biaku, you're not paying up for me. I can't help it. They both begin with bees. <laughs> Although that would be rather funny, that Biaku, you yeah, just decided to cross over to a whole another universe in what? fucking. Would that really some superheroes, you know? Would that really surprise you, though? No. Like, I wouldn't Take my money, let me fuck you. I mean... I mean, the only thing I can really see for, see that happens bad from that is, to is Toko, like, coming, like, we becoming Genocide, Jack, or Jill, or show and trying to kill all the characters. Yeah, she just happens to trail along, and she's like, Hey! I don't like this. Oi! Are you having sex with my man? Actually, he's having sex with me. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you! But he's the one doing it to me! <laughs> she just kills all the- Like, no one can stop her. Like, none of the powers work on her. Then Bianca just keeps going because he's like, I want my money's worth out of this. I don't care if she's dead. <laughs> you know what? He probably would. Yeah. He seems like the type to just keep on going. Keep fucking, 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 fucking what? Just change, just keep, just change that song by Limp Bizkit rolling to fucking. And that's Bianca. Oh, no. And that's Bianca's <laughs> theme song. Actually, I, the only reason I bring those is because I remember like Curtis and Richard making a joke about it about that song, but it was called "Keep Bowling, 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 Bowling." You got a strike, but nobody cares. <laughs> like that was like they sa like they sang that in, like one of the let's plays like I think it was like during the um oh what was it it was like during the chicken run LP I think I'm thinking is that a I'm thinking if, I was thinking to myself is that a real fucking song or is that did they just make that up for shits and giggles 
But I don't know. Maybe maybe it's real, maybe it isn't. I just maybe made that up. But I will say this, like, the, like a good, like, three or four minutes has been more or less been talking about porn. <laughs> anyway, back to where I was going with the whole My Hero Academia porn that I was talking about. It ends with, like, um, Midoriya, like, it ends with Midoriya asking, man, Oraka, Oraka's been, like, gone for a while. I'm thinking, oh, that's sad. Oh. The poor boy. <laughs> he's like wondering where his girlfriend's gone to, but his girlfriend's now riding Bak Bakugo's freaking cock. <laughs> <laughs> and I think to myself, I don't really think Bakugo is really the type that really want to be involved with that kind of stuff. Like, I don't see him like being going saying, you know what, fuck it, I'll have sex with someone just to spite me to rear. Yeah, that would just not be his thing. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm thinking. This, I, like, there was even like some instances where like I, oh, that's, I don't I don't think um, I don't think um you is it you yeah or uh Lee uh, Lee how do you say is, I know it's how do you say um ten years first name. Is uh it, Ida. Oh, Ida. What, what what the fuck? Oh god, that, I know what I I know what I did wrong. I Mac I mixed Max just fucking first and last name together. <laughs> and I was calling him Ida. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's actually Ida. God damn it. I'm a fucking idiot. Ia Tinder. Ia Tinder. Ia Tinder. Because that's what it sounds like. Ia Tinder. Ia Tinder. No, I don't have Tinder. <laughs> you will be on Tinder now. <gasps> okay. Have you seen how much fucking weed I can buy for eight gold coins? <laughs> I can buy so much weed. Buy a load of weed. Oh, I can only buy nine. I'll buy nine you, weed, please. You can only buy nine weeds. I'll buy nine weeds, please. I got six. You, you have not enough space to carry so much more weed. I can't. Oh, wait, I got... you can only buy nine at a time? Yeah. That's so dumb. Not really. Because, like... The way it works is that you have like the counters have like a specific a specific amount of slots. So that's how it uh. works. I mean look. I'll bring it up real quick. Look, I only have like twelve slots for each counter's inventory. Uh. So like, But that's how it works, like I for Professor Express, I gotta get rid of this pot. Stick that in there. And then stick another one in there. Then I can I can make Yangus be the weed <laughs> carrier since he's abandoned. <laughs> it's perfect. They won't suspect it. They won't suspect it that Yangus is the one that's carrying weed. Uh, anyone else? I can get rid of some shite. Oh yeah, I can get rid of these stuff and put some cheese. I can put cheese in here. Ooh. Because you can use that in battle. Munchies like I think if you like you can get like different types of cheeses. And uh, I think like you can get like you can get like freezing cheese, like blazing hot cheese, and like munchies would breathe fucking fire. <laughs> so it's basically like munchies is like a fucking dragon or something like that. He's like got like the shits. That would actually be really funny. You, like you give munchies like the cheese, and you just pick him up, and he fires out fire out of his ass. Oh no! <laughs> Munchie, use shit cannon. <laughs> Oh! Use on the final Use it on Duel Magus. Oh god, what is this? The mice shit. <laughs> Actually, no, let's quickly try it out. Munchies. Use your cheese on them. Go, Munchies. Eat that cheese. See? <laughs> <laughs> Munchies can breathe fucking fire! He's the true MVP of the fights. He'll fuck up your shit. Oh well. Either way, let's actually go to the fucking cave now since, you know, that's like the main goal of this whole thing to go and get Valentina back our father's crystal ball. Crystal ball. Yes, cause she's apparently a gypsy. She speaks like a gypsy apparently. I also heard that they have a crypt and crystal ball inside the waterfall. I suppose the daughter of the great Count Russia would know that. Will you stop speaking like a fucking gypsy woman? 
Why does anyone have an accent? Because uh, uh, I speak the rusty, yes. <laughs> that's not, that's not gypsy at all! <laughs> Apparently, for what I remember is, because I actually have, like, I have the, um, a strategy guide for this game, which is actually being used to, like, um, support my monitor to make it rise up. But, uh, long story short is, the manual says that you need to, um, for the first boss, it's better to, like, use, like, um, boomerangs, apparently? Because apparently, like, a boomerang is actually a really good weapon to hit a lot of enemies, but I never, ever, ever use boomerangs. Oh, feels like, bad, man. No, nah, because boomerangs are shit. Like, the, like, the best boomerang weapons max, like, the best boomerang weapon you can get has, like, shit attack power. And, like, its max attack power is 95. And you can get, like, a sword that has... You can get, like... And the best, like, sword you can get for, like, the hero and Angelo is a hundred... Has an attack power 128. So what are you going to focus in? Fucking swords! It looks like we found it! Naturally, I'm coming with you, but I couldn't possibly put Madeir in danger. I'm sure you'll do a fine job of, of fighting the crystal ball about us, hero. We'll be waiting right here. You'll be careful on there. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> thanks, King Trode. I feel so good about myself now that I'm in this fucking cave with Yangus. What's that supposed to mean, Gav? You know what it exactly means. That's not very nice, Gav. I thought we were best friends. I thought we were mates. We're going... <laughs> You're just tagging along with me because I saved your life. That's not true. We've bonded together in the same hotel room. That's not true. <laughs> what the feck is this? Mecha Mina. Mina. Mecha Mina? What the feck is that supposed to mean? Oh, you know. Me Mecha Mina. Ha <laughs> ha. Good thing I've buffed up. Good thing I've got, like, good armor on. Otherwise, that probably would have hurt. Oh, no. I'm gonna get killed by fucking birds. Stupid bastards. Die! Poor bastard. Didn't stand a chance. <laughs> At least these things are giving me, like, decent XP. Now, I know there's actually a weapon I can get in here for the hero. Like, a good weapon. It's a copper sword. It's like... I mean, I can buy one. But what's the point? There's the map. The map of the Waterfall Cave! Woo! I can use the square button to do the map. Oh, I love the I love these kind of thing. Kind of oh my god, I just raised something. Level one is like overlapping the stairs. <laughs> god damn it, game! You didn't even think about maybe making the text a bit smaller just in case. Like what the fuck? You lazy bastards! Let's get my shoes wet. I come to look at the waterfall and I stumble upon this cave. <laughs> a waterfall cave is so intriguing. I was trying to explore, but I got lost and got myself completely lost. You said the same thing twice, actually. Don't judge, don't judge, don't, don't, don't judge. Okay, I'm looking at the waterfall. Thank you, come again. What the fuck is this thing? It's a, 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 bo a bubble sling. Kill it! Fucking kill it! It still had a smiley face when it died. It's like, oh, sweet relief. Like, sweet relief. I just wanted to die. <laughs> oh, cool, a Camaro wing. Perfect. I can use that to fly back to the town. Oh, you know, I can just grind up my freaking um, courage to get Zoom. I know I'm a dismal herb. Perfect. I'll, I'll be high for a week. And I love a hat. Perfect. Like, you know what? That would have been nice to know that. Then I could have saved some money and not buy one. But I'm not a fucking genius now, am I? I, like, only know, like, bits and pieces of, like, this. But I do know how to make the best weapon for the hero, and that's the Dragovian King Sword, which has an attack power of 138. Look at these little guys. They look so, so happy. Cute. Well, they have to die. <laughs> as soon as I said that, I killed them in one hit. Well, they have to die. Oh no. Burr, you killed my children. Burr. Dracula? You killed my children, you son of a bitch. How could you? 
What did they ever do to you they part from attack you first? I think you just oh, answered you know. I think you just answered your own question with that. That is vampirism. That is racist to the vampires. How do you know that how, did they turn into people? No, they're just vampire they're just bats, blur! Then they're not vampires then. Well they're vampire bats! That doesn't make them vampires. Oh, you're a vampirist! You're the racist of vampires! <laughs> you're a racist jackass! <laughs> I could be- I could be Dracula, but I'd choose not to be. Ow! Stop attacking me, you feckin' feathers, you twat! What I just said?! <laughs> and now you're dead! I just first of all, I just take off their heads when I kill them. I'm a bit of a mon- I'm a bit of a monster, like- God damn it! That's it. Lose your head. Maybe you are the true monster of the game, and they are in fact the heroes trying to stop you. What do you think this is, Undertale? Just, just, just don't spoil me. I haven't finished. It's not really spoiling anything because the main gist of it is trying to befriend the monsters. Yeah. It's not really spoiling anything. It's like it's not even doing anything. It's like if you play as a in fact, that doesn't even sound like something that would happen in Undertale when I really think about it. Oh, look, it's a, mo it's a mis mis mischievous mole with a shovel. <laughs> he looks very mis mischievous with his fucking shovel. Oh, God, fire! Good thing I'm too strong against actual attacks. Oh, no, it's psyching itself up. It's ready to fucking go! Oh, shit. I can't let it kill me, though, so I may have to kill it. Man, I feel so sorry for these bats. Go and get him, my children! Kill it! Kill these people! They are racist towards our kind! Blah. Oh no, it's at level 20! Kill it! Dead. This fucking fire has like such high, has like very low health, but high defense. Except when you use a spell on it and it kills it easily. That's what happens. Apparently, to kill a spirit, you use the thing that's actually weak against. Which doesn't make sense to me, because I would have thought a spirit would have actually been immune to spells. But I guess not. I mean, what, have I, what do I know? I'm not a connoisseur of RPGs. Like, I have to, like... Like, when I'm playing Trails of Cold Stew, I use a guy to make sure we have the optimal playthrough. Do you want to be this guy? Uh, well, well, you know, it's really early, but I have to come up and uh, talk to me about this, so, uh, I might not look like the pet that I came along earlier, but when you saw me, you ran away without saying a word. <laughs> Thank you, not coming here again! Uh, you know, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, that's not probably realized, uh, you'll have to fight me if you want to go any further. Uh, what, what do you think, brave enough for that? Are you brave enough for this yes. hammer up your ass? Uh, really? Uh, you're brave. Uh, you're brave. Uh, that means you must be a good fighter. Oh. Uh, 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 I know, in that condition of bravery, I, I'm gonna let you do. Yeah, uh, there you go. Uh, love you all. Be careful now. Thank you. Come again. <laughs> that seems like the perfect voice for a character like that. <laughs> He just- he sounds like the scared little shit. Oh look, it's a slime! Oh fuck you. Oh no, it's the dancing devils! Oh no. Not these fuckers again! Ow! Get out of here, motherfucker! Oh no, not that saltly dance. Oh, I didn't- it, it, <laughs> Yangus, <laughs> Yangus was like- uh, Yangus like, you want, it mate? He looked so unamused. He's like, oh, you want, mate? You wanna go? You gay. <laughs> the sultry dance is actually really funny when you see them dance. I think the hero has the best dance ever. <laughs> Let's go and talk to this buddy, the little slime over here. Hey buddy! What you doing all the way out here? Hi little guy! What are you doing? <laughs> Guess what? This passage is a dead end! Do you believe me? Yes. Yay, yeah, then I'll tell you something good. It, it, it's a dead end, but there's a treasure chest up there. 
Oh, thanks, little guy. I appreciate your honesty. I'm going to go kill myself. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, no. And he's the weakest enemy. He won't survive. <laughs> Actually, um... Later on in the game, you can get a you can get a thing called monster teams, where you get to, like find like Roman monsters out on the field and put them in your team. And um, one of the teams oh. you and one of the teams you can get is a team full of like um, of free slimes. And once you get these free slimes together, they become the king slime. <laughs> and they're like they're like stupidly powerful. Like they can actually like they can use like a thing called Omni Heal, and they can fire fucking they can fire fucking meteorites from the sky. Like they're not sh like, they're not shit. You don't want to mess with them. There's two teams that can do that can actually transform. They, they can fuse together. There's a team of slimes which I've just mentioned. There's a bunch and there's like a bunch of like, um, different type of um, stone materials you can get like stone man, brick man, and gold man, and they become the amazing Maxin, who has like the power to actually do stupidly powerful critical hits. Oh, he's like the best team you can have, like the for like the S rank team, and it's the best, and it's the soul we need. A, a widely used cop. What's what was that fucking called? Did that sword have like a bit of description going on for it? I want to I want to learn about the fucking sword. A widely used widely used sword made out of copper. Why the hell is it widely used? Well, it's like bet. Well, at least I got like a bit more of attack. But how much the flipping? How much my sword gave me? Oh fuck. No wonder I was doing shit damage. L <laughs> literally eight. Compared, Yangus was doing triple damage to compared to me. <laughs> Fuck's sake! Why the? Why is? Why is such a shitty club better than a fucking sword? Oh, you know. That doesn't make sense to me. But whatever, I'll accept that. I mean, it makes sense later on that. Like the best sword you can get from mi by using alchemy is the liquid is the liquid metal sword, because it's made out of fucking liquid metal from a liquid metal slime. Ooh. Oh yeah, um, you'll come across enemies that are known as the metal slimes, and they literally are the best way to grind for XP because, okay, a normal metal slime can give you 1,380 experience points. If you fight a liquid metal slime, it will give you 10,080 XP. But if you fight a king metal slime, they'll give you 30,000 XP. XP. But here's the thing. Oh, you bastard! Did you see how graceful that motherfucker was? He just dodged my attack. Okay, back to where I was going. But here's the thing. These things can't be killed normally. The only way you can kill them is either by being extremely lucky with them not escaping battle and whittling, the, and whittling their health down. Now, here's the thing. They don't have a lot of health, but they have a shit ton of XP. I mean, defense. So you have to, like, use characters that either have good way to attack them, like... Something like the hero and Angelo, who, ha who can get, like, skills like the metal, s metal Slash, which can do damage to metal types. Or... Have like characters like the hero and Yangus who have critical attacks like the lightning frost or the executioner. Mm. Now with those moves, um, in particular, like they have, they have the they have chances where you can actually kill the motherfuckers in like a one hit, but the problem is is that they have they don't have a very good they don't have a very high chance of actually doing that. So you have to be like really lucky. But we won't have to worry about grinding for, like, maybe end game content where we, like, decide to do the Jagovian trials. We have to fight a bunch of dragons. Mm. We won't get to that until, like, when we actually complete the game the first time. And then it, like, we have a dream where we see, like, the, see something and then we have to go to a fucking stone monument and go through a cave of fucking powerful enemies. And then we have to go and defeat a dragon. And then we have to go through his trials, and then we get good. Then we get the best equipment for the hero, and we get to learn about his past. What the mm. feck are these things? Oh no, he's naked and he blushed. Kawaii. That thing just made me slower. Oh, he stepped on me. I know I'm trash, but there was no need for that. 
Good, you ran out of MP, you fucker. Ow! Feckin' stop! I'll kill you! Oh, no. Wait, so hang on. I lost 10 agility, but Yankus lost 8. That's some biased right there. I mean, he's fat, so he's already slow enough. <laughs> oh! Alright, so we got 4. Uh... What should we give him? Should we increase his axes, or do we increase his humanity? Or will we increase anything else? Up to you. Uh, I, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> okay, so... What we have now is a club, but, um... Which is pretty alright, but if we want... Scythes are good for, like, stealing shit. Um, f Fist of Cups are just good for, like, trying to avoid enemies. And humanity's, like, good for, like... It's like good for comrade stuff. I think we should get some. I think we should get some humanity for Yangus. We need to make him more likable. <laughs> yeah, he, he's not likable right now. He's oh look, he's become soft-hearted. He's become soft-hearted, and he's learned. <laughs> he's learned whistle. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> he's gonna bring a, a cover of Floor Rider's whistle now. He's, he's like, I can whistle. That means I can make music now. Waterfall ahead, no littering. Who's littering the fucking waterfall? Oh, you know. Let's use, <laughs> let's use some of this weed. Heal up the party. There we go. We're now. Oh, wait, hang on. I probably should get some more cheese. That's probably like a good idea. We need more cheese. Give Munchies more chai's. He needs all that chai's. Chai chai. Chee-chee. Che che. Now, here we go. We're going down into the boss area. Because you can tell it's the boss area because the music's changed. We're going down, down, and an earlier round. Oh, no. Not again. Not you bastards again. Ow! Feckin' stop! I just healed! Oh, now Yangus has lost nine. He got a bit faster. I'm slowly getting there, Gob. I'm losing weight. Oh my god, look at that swift <laughs> dodge. And then he just boots Yankus. <laughs> His mouth was just open, figured, I made a terrible mistake. <laughs> Alright, how many points do I get here? I got a vac. Good. Uh, yes. We need one more point. To get um to get zoom for the hero, and that means we can travel to anywhere we want to go to, where we've actually been, like towns. Ooh. Makes it a lot more easy than buying fucking Camaro wings. Only part, only downside is it costs MP to use. What the f <laughs> Look, I see something on the veranda. Oh no, I didn't see that though. <laughs> <laughs> that just came out of nowhere. Die fire. That's not nice. We're just meat. We're just humble fire spirits. Just look at our sad faces. We didn't do anything to you. I mean, set you on fire. Oh. oh, you killed my brother. Oh, I'm sad. Oh. Well, now they're dead. Nothing was lost. It's a good day when the enemy dies. Wait, just... Yes, Sh shouldn't you heal first? I am, I'm just waiting. You can't do anything until you interact with the crystal ball, which is a good thing. So I don't have to, like, worry about fucking up. Look, enough. I have a healing spell! Perfect for that. And I don't have to, like, worry about my freaking, um, things. Only thing I need to worry about is if the fucking bastard fucking uses a... Fucking... Poison. <laughs> I was trying to think of the word of fucking, fucking, fucking poison. Fucking, fucking poison. <laughs> no, no, let's make Yangus go a bit faster. Yeah, now he has more agility. Now he's faster than Hero, I think. Wait, I think he is actually. No, they've got the same now. Perfect. Now, now they're both good. Good. Perfect. They both. No, they're both good. Good. <laughs> good. Perfect. If I want to compare, Yangus has better resistance, but I have more wisdom. He's stronger than I am, but I have better attack power because of my equipment, and I have more better defense. 
but I'm still at Yang six. Yangus is six should say no because he doesn't get any ladies. That's, <laughs> that's not what that means. <laughs> Crystal ball is suspended in the air. How? Sure. If you can't, if you can't explain it logically, it's probably magic. I mean, it is a crystal ball. Oh fuck! What the hell are you? Oh, Surprise! Surprise! Oh wait, I forgot to send the voice acting off. <laughs> Good. I actually like this guy's voice acting. People have gone and come. <laughs> come. Ten long years and more. I've waited ten years, I tell you. All the time hoping for the left one. <laughs> I mean the right one to come. The left one? Yes, I mean the left one. Wait, was it the right one or was it the left one? I can't remember now. <laughs> <laughs> the true man of move. <laughs> that guy's face basically describes how he looks like a fucking retard. Yeah. I know two plus two equals seven. No, 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 wait, it's 21. <laughs> or was it, or was it four? No, no, it was three. Or maybe it was four. <laughs> No, no, maybe, wait. Maybe, maybe it's negative 25. <laughs> maybe it's male. <laughs> <laughs> maybe it's male. Or maybe, maybe it's Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> maybe it's female. Oh, wait, no. That even numbers and odd numbers. So maybe an even number means male and an odd number means female. But that doesn't make sense then. Wait. If two is an even number and men have two balls, but then female also have two <laughs> pairs, have a pair of boobs, and they have two boobs, but that doesn't make sense then, but you're right. Wait. Ah. Uh, I think I confused myself now. <laughs> the Miss Bristol Call Crystal Ball belong to you. I don't know. I think my version was better where he's just trying to figure what two plus two is. <laughs> uh. No. <laughs> oh, long, lonely years. Go then. My wait continues. Oh. <laughs> oh, I just told him to piss off. Maybe I can actually get the freaking crystal ball now. And maybe he won't come back. <laughs> maybe that's how that works. Maybe I just need to pit tell him to piss off and I can just steal it. You know, that makes perfect sense. Oh no, he's no. back! Oh, he's back again! What? You again? I, Giza, am the master of this waterfall, I tell you! I, I know that, I, I just met you a second ago! Oh, how long is ten long? <laughs> oh my god, he's repeating. Have I asked you this before? Yeah, yeah, I've never heard before. I've never heard before. Like, I like how he had the guy actually put, like, fucking tongue-twisting fucking sound effects into his dialogue. <laughs> Biffery. Biffery. <laughs> yes. <laughs> At last. At last we fit mace to mace. You half-wit human. Beg your pardon? I don't know who, I don't know, I don't know why you've been waiting for my feet, but you've never met mace to mace before. <laughs> I don't even have a mace. I don't even have mace with me. I can use pepper spray. <laughs> That'd be really funny, he just pulls out a bunch of pepper spray and sprays them in the eye. I, mean a lesson. I will teach you a moron. I think you need to go and teach yourself first before you call me a moron. But do Wait, hold on, we're on to violence. This doesn't seem right. Did you see the hero's face? Like, he was just like super shocked. He's like thinking, oh shit, what the fuck have we done? Oh no. Quick, power up to maximum. We have to beat him. 
The hero has no idea what the hell's going on. He's like super shocked. <laughs> what the hell's this thing gonna do? Oh. Oh. Yankus is cursed, but I'm apparently immune to curses. You know what? I'll take that. I'll take being immune to curses. Ow! Fuck! That was actually a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. He hits you again, you're fucking dead, man. <laughs> Not for long. Use the weed. Ah, now I'm doped up and ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm at 50. <laughs> Yang has got big slapped. <laughs> Jesus Christ, my fucking glass jaw. Oh, he's doing it again. Yang is now. What's happening? Uh I am the legendary Super Saiyan! Behold my power! Uh, uh, y <laughs> Yangus is just, he's just taking a nap right now, but I'll take care of it. So Yangus is just like, yeah, cool. Yangus, you just like, just you power up, I'll take care of it. Sizzle? Why does a water thing know how to use fucking fire? Get out of here, bitch! Oh, I thought that would kill him. Oh, now I look, now I look angry. The hero is just like going. He's like, figure, oh, I weaken him now. Maybe he will actually die in one hit or something. <laughs> there you go, Yangus. Get yourself meffed up. Cheers, Gov. Oh, yeah. Get that meff. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm coming down. <laughs> <laughs> like he gets hit and he's like starting to come down from the drugs. Oh, no, I'm coming down already, Gov. Take that. He's like going, ah! Damn it! Oh, no. oh no, not again! Damn it, Yagus! Fuck it. I'll just go balls in. Ow, feck. Yeah, I'm gonna die, I know it. Uh, heal. Now. Yagus, hit him. Oh, good. Thank God for that. Yagus, I don't care if you kill him, just make sure he doesn't kill me. More weed. Yep, Yangus, you're supposed to kill him, <laughs> not not puss out. Okay, we did some damage. What's he gonna do now? Is he gonna curse Yangus again? Oh, he's doing it again. Oh, good, Yangus, you did something. You deflected it. A, a full on attack. Oh, feck. Oh no, Yangus, hit him. Oh, for feck's sake, Yang, you're supposed to try to kill him in that time. I'll attack, you heal yourself with the weed. Now oh, I'm still not dead. Piss and vinegar. There we go. Nice and doped up. And Yang has got smacked again. <laughs> Come on, this should be the last hit. There we go. Yay. First try to. He looks so sad. He's like... <sighs> he gave me 107 XP and gave me 108 gold. Fucking cheapskate. Oh, cool. I got a seed of power. Or strength, whatever. Same thing. I think you got your words mixed up. I think I think that old I think the battle may have made your old wound even worse. And it's all because of you. Well, I mean, I did fight you, but you're the one that came at me first. What? You don't know what I'm talking about? Then you Yes, you're right. I don't have a fucking clue what you're what you're talking about. Actually I've just realized something. You can actually see um you can actually see for the crystal ball his actual arm and body. That's actually a nice detail. Ooh. Nice work, guys. You're <laughs> not the true owner of this crystal ball. No, the shame, the shame. I would have thought that maybe me saying no before would have gave you a clue, but all right, buddy. So strong, strong enough to withstand my fearsome might. You are no tortune fella. 
Yes, you're right. I'm definitely no torch, tortured, tortune fella. It would be funny if you actually said torture fella. <laughs> you are no torture fella. <laughs> you are no tortune fella. <laughs> So the waterfall tells jokes now? I like to actually see the I actually would like to see the waterfall at a comedy at a comedy night. <laughs> That's actually really funny. Please welcome to the stage. Hang on, wait a minute. Please welcome to the stage Waterfall! <laughs> oh my god, it's amazing! It's so hot! And it's just like the waterfall just like says nothing and everyone just applauds and claps him. <laughs> yeah, we love you, waterfall! He enters and just drowns everyone because he's just a mass of water. <laughs> like, everyone's going, yeah, woo! <laughs> How do you know about fucking Castle Trodane and you know about being cursed and it was run over? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I heard, I hear that a castle called Troden has been cursed. That it was run over by a guy with a giant pair of nuts. Oh my god. Why am I smiling? I could have sworn he's <laughs> that fucking face. He's <laughs> just like, mm hmm. I could have I sworn, like, he's supposed to be, like, kind of confused about the whole thing but he's just like yeah <laughs> yeah i don't know why he's doing that like that's weird maybe it's i i don't think it is but maybe it has something to do with the fact being that this isn't actually a proper copy of dragon quest 8 and it's actually an american version put onto a dvd which is playing on a soft modded ps2 I mean, I could have played the original one. I have it, but I didn't want to. I wanted to play it on a. I wanted to play the American version because it's actually a lot more smoother. For whatever reason. What happened? Where am I? What What happened? Oh. As I thought, that was you. Yes, yeah, so I wonder why I was the only one who didn't get affected by the fucking curse. I don't know what you want with this crystal ball. We know there's something up, because the fact being that I was the only one who didn't get affected by a curse is a little bit weird. Like, the curse just literally evaporates when it got near me. But it's yours now. I accept the hands. Oh, you accept the hands? Okay, give me your hands or cut them off then. No! <laughs> no! Ah! <laughs> no, my hands! Now I will be able to rub my old wound. One last thing. Should you meet the true owner of this crystal ball, tell him this from me. Sure, what's up? But you're gay for him and you want to give him your fish dick? In the fall water. How the fuck do you mix that up? It's waterfall. <laughs> Where the fell? Oh, the pain, the pain, the pain of my old wound. The pain, the pain of my old wound on my penis. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Did you see that for a brief second? <laughs> my, my clothes like went weird for a second. <laughs> oh no. Don't tell me this is a weird copy. Maybe that explains why he wasn't smite. Maybe that's the reason why he was acting weird. Can you just use evac to get him? Or do you have to walk all the way out? I could do that, but I... Fuck it. I wanted to get to level 7 real quick as the hero, so... But I don't know how long um... that would take... I don't know how long that would take me, though. It's really funny when someone dies in this game. <laughs> Oh, it is like when you get into the fucking battle, like there's just a fucking coffin right next to you. <laughs> it's really funny just to stare at. Why is there a dead guy right next to you? Don't ask questions about that. Don't ask questions about the dead body. First rule of Dragon Quest, you don't ask about the coffin. <laughs> For 
Alex Ruin by Dragon Quest. You never mentioned anything about the dead bodies. Thank God Whistler only does not, literally doesn't give, do anything to your AP, your MP. Can you imagine if it cost actual points? <laughs> what a rip off it will be then. But that guy's dead. And this should be the amount I need. There we go, level seven. Perfect, now we're level seven now. We should now have enough to boost up my thing. Yes. We do it in eight, and we now increase swords next. Perfect. We now have he gains the courage to set forth on his journey. He learns zoom. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here now. We can now leave this place by using the vac.